Do you have any reaction to um, Ennis Cantor using your likeness on his shoes in his uh, advocacy for human rights? Um, no, I think if you know me, I don't really give too many people my energy. Um, you know, and um, he's definitely not someone I will give my energy to. Um, you know, trying to use my name to create, you know, an opportunity for himself. Um, um, definitely won't uh, comment too much on that. Um, if any, and that that'll be where I lay that at. Um, you know, he's always, you know, kind of had a you know a word or two to say, you know, in my direction. Um, you know, and as men, you know, if you got really if you got an issue with somebody, you really come up to him. He had his opportunity tonight. Face, I seen him in the hallway. He walked right by me. So, you know. Thank you. What LeBron said there is true. Ennis Cantor has always had a little bit of beef with LeBron James. They were talking trash when Ennis Cantor was on the Knicks, and they've always kind of gone back and forth with each other. But this, this is a whole new level. So if you look closely at the shoes, there's a picture of LeBron James, a bunch of money bags behind him, and he's bowing down to China. And also on the other shoe, there was uh, I'm educated on this situation because LeBron likes to say that about a lot of different topics before he speaks about them. So Ennis Cantor took advantage of the situation by writing on his shoe, I'm informed and educated on the situation, with a hand covering the mouth of a mask or a face, and that face is LeBron James, because he's saying that, LeBron, yes, you do your research and you know what's going on, but you choose to stay silent so that way you can keep your money. Cantor also fired up a tweet saying, money over morals for the king. Sad and disgusting how these athletes pretend they care about social justice they really do shut up and dribble when Big Boss says so. Did you educate yourself about the slave labor that made your shoes? Or is that not part of your research? Over the years, we've seen a lot of people call it LeBron James, whether it's the media, coaches, GMs, you name it, but we've never seen another player take a shot quite like this at LeBron. This isn't about LeBron's style of play. This isn't about his antics, his flopping. This isn't even about some of the things he says on Twitter. This is a whole new level. He is calling out LeBron James's entire brand here. But now I really want to hear from you guys in the comments section down below. Whose side are you on here? LeBron James or Ennis Cantor? And what do you think of the whole situation in general? Also, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like on it as it really helps out the channel. And don't forget to subscribe for more NBA content just like this. And I will see you in the next upload.